Well, dozens of family and friends gathered here right where the accident happened, leaving behind a small memorial. They say Brasher's death has impacted the entire community. He's one of like the truest friends you could ever have. According to those who knew him, Christian Brasher was someone special. He enjoyed basketball, rap music, and skateboarding, and he loved his friends. Everybody loved him because he was friendly. You know, he's the type of person that you just you want to have as a friend, and you'd be lucky to have. He made a tragic mistake late Sunday evening when he was trying to beat a train across the tracks. According to investigators, he ran across the tracks with another teen who was on a skateboard. Brasher didn't make it. I actually didn't get any sleep at all last night because I kept hearing the train. The sight and sound is common in Claremore, with about 40 trains passing through the city limits every day. Everyone who lives about here has ran in front of a train. No one ever thinks about it, but it really can happen to anybody. And this just shows you what can happen. Police hope if any good can come from this tragedy, other kids take heed. Basically, the, the boys crossed when, when the warnings were activated to not cross. Um, so, so for parents and children, don't try to don't try to outrun the train. Because that familiar sound is now a painful reminder. Now that you hear a train, you, that first picture in your mind, you're like, he's gone. He's not here. Don't walk away from them mad. Because you might just regret what you said, because I regret what I said to him. The high school and a local church will continue to have grief counselors available to students. In Claremore, Brianne Pomerini, 2 News, works for you.